Hello everyone. Now we will be going to discuss. We will be going to discuss very important topic that is eigenvectors and modal markings. Uh, eigenvectors to define eigenvectors. Any non-zero vector x i such that a x i equal to lambda x i is said to be the eigenvector associated with the eigenvalues. So here we have lambda i minus a into x equal to zero. So this is how we will calculate the eigenvector. We will uh, <coughs> this will be cleared. Uh, this is very simple, and it will be cleared in the upcoming example. Then how we will calculate the eigenvectors. And this is an important property. The diagonal of the matrix is R. Then there are n minus R independent eigenvectors. Similarly, in another important point is that if the eigenvalues of the matrix A are all distinct, then the rank of the matrix A is n minus one, where n is the order of the system. And uh, mathematically, the eigenvector can be calculated by taking the cofactors of the matrix, lambda i minus a, along any row. This will be easily explained in the upcoming example. So this is how we this is eigenvector m i. For lambda i, so what is model matrix? Model matrix is uh, the the uh, bigger matrix which is containing all the eigen vectors. So such a matrix obtained by placing all the eigen vectors together is called a model matrix, or the normalizing matrix of the matrix A. So this is the model matrix. Here we see M1, M2, to M n. Another important property when we will get the matrix A, here we have another important property M inverse A into M. We get this alpha, which is the diagonal matrix. What is a diagonal matrix? It is a matrix. Here we have the eigenvalues on the main diagonal, and all other entries are zero. So we will prove it in upcoming example. And this is another uh, matrix uh, which is known as Venter. Uh, Mon matrix. So, if the state model is obtained using the phase variables, then the matrix A is in Bush form or phase variable form, as A equal to this is the form, and the characteristic equation that is the denominator is like this. So, in such a case, model matrix takes the form of the special matrix. So, this is called Vander Mon matrix of this form. First row one one one, second row lambda one, lambda two, up to lambda. And on the third row, we have the square. Similarly, the last row would be uh, the power n minus one of the eigenvalues. Now, this is an example. We will calculate a lot of very important things. Uh, here, we have a three by three matrix. We will calculate. We we are required to calculate the characteristic equation, eigenvalues, eigenvector, model matrix. And also, we will prove that m inverse a m is uh, gives us the diagonal matrix. So, so first of all, we will calculate lambda i minus a. So lambda i minus a gives us this, and we calculate this determinant. It's a third order equation. So for this, we have a very quick process. We will write a coefficient, and we will select score. We will test it for minus two. So one, one here, and then we multiply it with two minus two. Add up, we get seven. Seven multiplied by minus two, minus fourteen, we have the twelve, and then multiply. Uh, with uh, minus two, we get minus twenty-four and zero. So it's a remove. So for the other uh, equation, we get lambda square plus seven lambda plus twelve equal to zero. So here we have lambda plus two into lambda square plus seven lambda plus twelve, and this is further uh, divided into roots as lambda plus two and lambda plus four. So here we have the three eigenvalues: minus two, minus three, and minus four. Now we will calculate the eigenvector. We have calculated the eigenvalue, and now we will calculate the eigenvector. Eigenvalue minus two, we will calculate as lambda i minus a. So we will put the value of minus two into the earlier matrix lambda i minus a. We get this one. And now how we will calculate the eigenvector? We can we uh, it, uh, I told you that it's the cofactor along any row. So we will calculate the cofactor along the first row. So 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 calculating the cofactors. We can calculate the cofactor, uh, and this is how we obtain the cofactors. 20 minus 20 minus 40 would we'll take the common factor, and 1 minus 1 minus 2. Similarly, for lambda 2 uh, is equal to minus 
we get the cofactor along this and hence this. So we get M, M2, M3 eigenvectors and the model matrix, model matrix will be the combination of all these three uh, column vectors. So this is the model matrix for minus 1 to 1. And now the last part of the question it will have to prove that uh, M inverse going to M gives us the diagonal matrix. So we will calculate its inverse. Again, its inverse square would be a rank over M mod. So M mod is equal to minus 1. It's not a, it's a non-similar matrix. And here its inverse we calculated as like this. And uh, this is how we calculated AM. And then we calculated my M inverse AM, which is equal to this matrix. And remember, we have minus 2 equal to lambda 1, minus 3, minus lambda 2, and minus 4, lambda 3. So we get this diagonal matrix. Hence, it proves that uh, M inverse A and is equal to the diagonal matrix of the eigenvalues. So, thank you very much for listening.